Hey guys, it's Landon McCarter with Secure Agent Marketing. Um, I'm here to talk about a very important question that we get asked all the time, which is, should you use AdWords, Google AdWords in the insurance industry? Before I answer this question, I wanna pro provide a little bit of context of why I feel qualified to answer this question. I'm not just a random guy that is gonna give you his opinion on AdWords, okay? Before I started Secure Agent Marketing with Cody Askins, I ran a $4 million digital marketing agency. One of our primary products was Google AdWords. One of the things that I have been doing for Cody is running and, and overseeing his AdWords account from the very beginning. And I fell in love with the insurance industry specifically, primarily because AdWords was really driving a lot of conversions and leads for us. And it was a really fun product to use um, for insurance marketing specifically. I have personally overseen and spent millions and millions of dollars of other people's budget, along with my own, on different various Google AdWords um, campaigns, okay? I'm a Google Premier Partner, I've been a partner, I've, I know if there's one topic that I can speak very clearly on, it is gonna be Google AdWords. So what I wanna do is I wanna answer a few questions for you guys and just kinda do a little bit of education because we get this quite a bit, okay? First off, I wanna make sure that you guys understand what Google AdWords is. Google AdWords is one of the oldest, oldest digital marketing products that exists it is why Google is a multi-bazillion dollar company and why they're just a monsters. This is what they do very well and that is called search advertising, okay? Google AdWords is search advertising. What that means is, is that whenever you Google a keyword term, you can pay per click to be on the top of that list for whatever that keyword is and then pay for that website traffic to your site, to go to your landing page, to go into your marketing funnel, whatever you want to do. So Google AdWords is the product name to actually do the pay-per-click advertising. Another term for it is called SEM, Search Engine Marketing. So you can do pay-per-click, which is PPC. Um, you can do that with Bing, you can do that with Yahoo, you can do it with Google. Most people focus in on Google AdWords because they're the market leader and that's where most people are Googling the keywords that we want to track. Not to say that you can't do Yahoo and Bing, uh, pay-per-click advertising, etc. So that's what Google AdWords is. One of the things that Google is not known as much for that is really serves the insurance industry the best, or not the best, but um, very well, is, is what's called pay-per-call advertising. So Google is continually building out their calling platform to where we can also build campaigns within Google AdWords that aren't per click, but they are per call. So there's lots of really interesting marketing campaigns we can develop where you can actually, you know, not pay for clicks to your website, but only pay for calls when someone's looking up final expense insurance or life insurance or whatever. So pay per call is also a, a really awesome product within the Google AdWords platform, right? So how it all works, it really is simple, okay? Google AdWords is a gigantic auction. What everyone is doing that plays ball on the Google AdWords platform is they're bidding what I'd be willing to pay per click for a certain keyword, okay? So the way it works is, is if you want to buy the keyword term, you know, universal, index universal life, for instance, and you want to drive them to your landing page, you would say, I'd be willing to pay $2 or $3 or $4, whatever that number is per click. All of the other people that want to bid on that keyword would also be play, paying, you know, and bidding on that keyword specifically. And whoever wins that click is who gets to be number one versus number two. So I'm gonna have Dylan show up a screen of like a Google term where there's, you know, one spot, two spot, three spot, four spot, right? So it costs more money to be on the top spot than it does to be on the second spot, than it does to be on the third spot, than it does to be on the fourth spot, et cetera. So it's all a big game. Right? It takes a lot of management by professionals. That's why you really shouldn't be managing your own Google AdWords account because typically professionals can do it uh, much more efficient and drive much more lower cost leads, cost calls, et cetera, than what you would be able to do by yourself if you're not actually certified in doing that yourself. So a lot of times Google AdWords professionals are, are paying for themselves and they're very, they're very inexpensive when it comes to, you know, if you're spending that money yourself, you're probably wasting a percentage versus what an individual could actually manage your account for you and save that money for you and give you a better account and lead quality, et cetera. So when do you wanna use Google AdWords? Now, there's two main criteria that I try and teach people when it comes to when you wanna use Google AdWords. The first criteria is, is there a demand for the keyword that you're wanting to buy? So there's keyword research, 
um, that you can do to make sure that there actually is people Googling this keyword that we want to buy in your specific area. Most of the time, there is. The only time I ever get worried about people doing pay-per-click advertising is if you Google the keyword and nobody is buying ads in that keyword, that means that keyword isn't driving results, therefore no one's bidding on it, therefore you shouldn't either, right? So first, there has to be a demand. If you want to understand how this works from a conceptual perspective, we are only bidding to show our ad in the first spot whenever that keyword is Googled. If we are, if you can't show up for the first spot if it's not being Googled. So there's not a demand in your area, you can only, you, you can't do Google AdWords because you can't show up because no one's Googling it, right? So that's the first thing. The second thing is, is you've gotta have a budget that is sizable enough to be able to make a dent in the Google AdWords platform. Google will tell you, just Google what's the recommended spend for Google AdWords campaign. They will say at least $1,000 a month. The reason it's at least $1,000 a month is because the way Google works is you set a daily budget per click per call. So if your budget gets too thin, your daily budget is like $7 a day or $12 a day or whatever. And the particular keyword that you're bidding on, maybe three to four to five dollars per click or per call or whatever. So you're only getting three clicks a day. Your budget's gonna be done by 10 a.m. or you're only gonna be able to have your ads live for three weeks out of the month or two weeks out of the month, etc. So depending on the demand, depending on the budget, that's how you come up with your, um, if you should you know, use Google AdWords. So if there is a demand, and you have a budget of at least $1,000 a month, typically around $1,000 to 2500 is a good starting budget to try out Google AdWords, depending on the size of your organization. If you're already doing Google AdWords, that's a whole different story. You can typically optimize further with a professional that way. So what is the goal of Google AdWords, right? So really the goal is very simple. We're trying to drive conversions, leads, calls, landing page form fills, etc. If you're doing Google AdWords just for clicks, you're doing it wrong. No one, we're kind of evolved to the point where people are just putting money in the coin slot and hoping they get conversions, but you wouldn't be surprised. I'd be, you would, you would be surprised on how many people are currently doing Google AdWords and they don't have conversion metrics set up. They don't know what their cost per conversion is. What, what is a conversion? I've met with so many people that are working with rookie AdWords people that whenever I ask them what their cost per conversion is, they don't even know how to answer the question. Well, that's a poor job by their AdWords professional to educate them on what the purpose is of this whole thing. We don't care about buying clicks, we care about buying conversions and leads. And really we don't even care about leads, we care about sales and revenue. So if I'm spending $1,000 a month on AdWords and driving you know, $5,000 a month of sales with a commission at 20% or whatever, you end up making your money that way, as opposed to um, you know, hoping that they convert by driving clicks to a landing page and just kind of crossing your fingers, right? It's, it's a broken way to look at it. I'm gonna do a more advanced video on Google AdWords later, but for the basics, this is what I wanted to cover, right? So the goal of AdWords is conversions, calls, leads, etc. cetera, right? Should you use AdWords? I'll be the first to tell you that there's probably cheaper ways to drive leads than doing Google AdWords if you don't have much of a budget. I'm telling you, Google AdWords is more of what I would call like the big league of digital marketing. You gotta have a bigger budget to play. There's bigger players in the industry, but I will tell you that the insurance keywords in the Google platform are the most Googled keywords and some of the most expensive keywords in the nation. If you go do your research, you'll find that it's insurance and insurance products specifically. So should you do AdWords? Yes, but you should not do AdWords if you don't have enough budget to play ball and get yourself moving for at least three to four to five to six months to determine if that Google AdWords budget is going to serve you well from a return on investment standpoint. Secure Agent Marketing is a full service digital marketing agency that can build and help you with your AdWords campaigns. We can audit your campaign if you don't trust your current um, you know, ad, uh, advisor or whatever that is, we can get in there, audit it. All we do is insurance marketing. All we do in AdWords is insurance marketing, whether it's Medicare, whether it's ACA, whether it's final expense, whether it's IUL, whatever it is, okay? This is all that we do. Now, I wanna make sure that you're being served correctly because you can burn through thousands of dollars of budget without having a professional. So I'd love to talk to you about your AdWords account and help you if you can. Um, we'll talk soon, see you.